how to download this. Go to Neighbor Maps on your App Store and then search it and download this. Once you download it, click the checkbox and click the blue button. Here, click that icon. And here is Settings. Click that on all, which is the language, and then change it to English. And here you see now the English maps. From here, I'll show you how to use the subway map. So click that one and click subway. It will pull up the subway map in Seoul. And here I'm going to walk you through how to use this. Click City Hall and from and click Myeongdong and to. And here you can see how long it would take from subway station and how to get there by transferring each subway. You can do this to any other stations. Now I'm going to show you how to use directions. So this is useful when you're trying to go from somewhere to somewhere. So let's say we are at City Hall. So let's say type City Hall. And then let's say we want to go to Lotte World Mall, right? So here we type Lotte World Mall as a destination. And here you can see now by car, it takes about 58 minutes at this time of the hour. Now, if you click that left tab, it will show you the subway, uh, how long it would take. For, for example, at 4 p.m., it will take about 35 minutes to get there by subway. The cool thing about this is you can exactly calculate how to get here from where you are. So for example, City Hall, that dotted blue line was walking. And then once you get off at the subway stop, you will walk toward Lotte World Tower. So that's how you navigate around Seoul. The red means the traffic is heavy on that road. Okay, if you want to walk, you can do it. 3 hours and 46 minutes. And bike, you can do it too. It's going to be a good exercise. So let's look at how to find the restaurants. So you kind of go through where you are at and then click that restaurant icon. And then it will show you all the restaurants in there. So let's look at cafe, right? So let's, you are here and you are, if you click that cafe button, it will show you a lot of different cafes right there. Now, sometimes you have this English address and you want to convert it to Korean address and then paste it onto your neighbor maps. So how do you do this? Go to juso.go.kr and copy and paste your English address onto your juso.go.kr and then convert it and then copy it again and then you put it onto your neighbor maps and it will show you like that. Now, if you want the step-by-step -step guidebook that lists what to do in South Korea and where to eat location by location, and I have created the PDF guidebook. It lists all different restaurants, all different places organized by locations. So neighborhood by neighborhood. This is going to save you tons of time and you will be able to know exactly what to do at exactly what time because it's organized by locations. So go ahead and check it out. The link is in bio.